Three, two, one. June's mission discovery voyage to the International Space and Station will see an unusual off, variety of passenger on board, rocket. a cargo of Daphnia, a type of water flea. University of Birmingham bioscientist Dr K Van Dam is preparing the tiny crustaceans for their trip to Cape Canaveral and then out of space. It's a one-way trip unfortunately, they will not come back from the space station and during their stay there they will be observed by astronauts who will uh, take observations and look at the animal's survival and behaviour in space. Looking for signs of stress, the astronauts will monitor the Daphnia behaviour during their month-long trip. Daphnia are one of the major animals used by biologists as a model organism for biomedical research. Trying to assess its viability in space stations opens the possibility to explore this for the future and actually see how Daphne can be used to assess either human health or to set up small freshwater self-sustaining self ecosystems in space. The project was the brainchild of students from the Welsh town of Rhonda Cunnan Taff. They won a contest run by the International Space School Education Trust, King's College London and Mission Discovery. Dr Julie Keeble from King's says children's ability to think outside the box can be illuminating. So scientists do get caught up within their research field, we work in our grants and so on and so forth and then a school a pupil can come along and learn about what we've been doing and come up with something really related but something that we wouldn't necessarily thought of ourselves. As the countdown to launch begins, Van Dam says one small leap for these water fleas could spur one giant future leap for mankind. <laughs>